Yeah, the International, um, it's an inland links. It really plays um, a lot different to the heritage. It's a lot of undulation, um, some cracking par threes over water, particularly eight and 12. Uh, we'll test the guys out with their club selection. Some really um, exciting par fives with water involved as well and some elevation. So it's a great test for the guys. And it's also um, a, a course that we really pride ourselves on. Um, Lee Sayers, the course superintendent and his team have been working really hard. Um, obviously watering's been a priority, but um, they've, they've really prepared the course well on the greens and they've worked hard. The rough isn't quite as punishing as it has been. It's got that kind of linksy feel. But we had some rain recently and it's just softened the, the course up a little bit and taken the fire out of it. So I think uh, the guys are really going to enjoy the, the test it presents. The greens are running very true. They take a really good shot, so they're, not, they're, they're nice and firm, so the guys can get some good spin, control their golf shots into the green. But when it comes to the putting, they're nice and true, fast. The balls are running really well, so um, yeah, I think we'll, uh, the guys are really going to enjoy putting on them and playing on them. Kent traditionally produces good crowds. There's some great names, obviously. Uh, Paul McGinley, Colin Montgomery headlining the event, so uh, I really hope that, uh, that the guys in Kent come out in the local counties as well, and let's hope we can get some good support and uh, create a good atmosphere for the, for the event.